that's uh, I mean, dude, that's all they know. It's all they, it's all they know sometimes, and hmm, it's a, it's just a bummer. Just a bummer, man. Lose a good guy like that, man. Like I said, I ain't into his shoes, so I don't know what was up in his head, but damn. I wish he could have uh, did something different. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Those, those boys who play football, they know one other thing. That's how to spend their money. So he had his rest of his life to spend all that money. Shit, it just don't make sense to me. I'd be living, I'd be out there getting fatter every day. I hear you, brother, but they say sometimes money can't buy you happiness, bro. I guess that's some proof right there. Money can't buy you happiness. There's your proof right there, Captain Bigger. I guess so. I sure as hell would like to try some, though. Yeah, I would like to see what it's like not having to live paycheck to damn paycheck. <laughs> I'd like to see what that's all about, Captain Bigger. Stretch limousines and... A girl under each arm. Of course, don't tell the wife, but... <laughs> yeah, man, it's all good, baby. Lord have mercy. Oh, yeah, fancy cars. That's what's on right now, the Bennett Jackson car auction. I was just watching them auction off those old cars. They set out a 59 Caddy that was just been redone. And I mean, this is a beauty. 24000 bucks. Holy smokes, why it go so cheap, man? Yeah, I was just looking at a 52 Caddy, man. I was looking at a 52 Caddy. I love big, fat lead sleds, man. I love lead sleds, man. I was looking at a 52, uh, I was looking at a 52 Caddy, man. Doggone, beautiful, man. Beautiful car. Yeah, I'd like to get one of those, uh, uh, 50, uh, 49 fastback Caddies, you know, with the rollback. Yeah, I like like a 51 Merc. I love old cars like that, man. Big stout. Cut them, chop them tops a little bit, man. Lower them down a little bit. Tuck them tires in. Oh, yeah, brother. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I've had me a lot of old cars. I had an old 37 Oldsmobile I used to do weddings in. Thing was bad. I got a picture of it sitting right in front of me on the wall. Love them old cars, man. Love them old cars, 55 Chevys. Everyone likes those 57s. I think the 55 is the toughest one out of them all, man. I think the 55 is the toughest one out of them all. Yeah, I like the 55 myself, because it's got that, that kind of an oval grill. really looks kind of mean, a little rounder than the 56. Not as sharp as the 56, more... Yeah, Rogers, got that stance, like, you know what I mean? It looks like it's going fast just sitting there. Looks like it's going fast just sitting there. Boy, the big back seats. Man, God bless a car with a big back seat, man. Uh, got the old drive-in. Come on, half of us were made right there. Oh, yeah, brother. <laughs> Oh, man, they make these cars today, man. You can't even fit in them, man. Can't barely get in the headroom. Everyone's pushed up against the guy in front of them. Back then, man, you were just laid back. And when you had your girl with you, shoot, all you needed was a blanket in the trunk. Come on down. <laughs> I'm right here. Hang on, man. I'll talk to the sweet thing real quick.
Get on down. Where you at there, troublemaker? I'm pulling into uh, Ramona right now. Are uh, you coming around to Big Mountain? Oh, my God. Come on, homeboy, you still in there? Oh, yeah. I'm sitting right here getting it all fixed up. Oh, sorry about that. Yeah, the sweet thing came in here. You know how it is, man. You got to talk to, got to, talk to the lady. You got that right. <laughs> you got that right. She always tell me, you never talk to me. You always talk to your friends on the radio. I told her, well, damn, there's the problem right there. Get a radio. Put one of your cars sit outside and talk to me, baby. There you go. Shoot, we'll fat lip all night long. Yeah, there you go. Talk all night long, honey. Just get yourself a radio and, and talk to me. Talk nasty to me, and I'll show up at your door. Yeah, maybe this Christmas I get a walkie-talkie, man. Man, I get a walkie-talkie this Christmas. Yeah, she can be in the bedroom, see? She can break on in and say, it's time. Break up, break up. <laughs> Any takers. <laughs> yeah, man, that's some good stuff right there. You need a walkie-talkie there, uh, uh, 4040. That way you be able Look at John Denver. Dude, I, I could key on you with a walkie-talkie. Shoot, that's all I need to take you out, Ken, because of walkie-talkie. Get over to Sears and Roebuck and go pick me one up. You haven't seen my walkie-talkies, buddy. I'll cut your radio off. I think Big Phil's got one of my walkie-talkies, and I know it'll cut your radio off. Oh. And Big, Big Phil was just cutting you off right now. No, that was Troublemaker. Oh, Troublemaker was cutting you off. What the hell? I hear a skyscraper out there too. I